So we have the objective to go after the safe house to get uh, Dominic, but hey, I'm not done exploring this place yet, so it's going to have to wait. Hi. Hello, I am intruding on your night now. Now I'm your problem. How you doing? Best club in Prague, friend. But I'm busy right now. Oh, well, at least he acknowledges that, I, that he's busy a little bit. I'm gonna take that. Thank you. And that. You're welcome, everybody. How you doing? tissue. Alright. Have fun. Being fully clothed or whatever. Whatever you do in clubs. What the hell? Look at this guy. Who goes clubbing with like a backpack and like multi-layered jackets with double hoods on at the same time and combat boots? Like, are you trying to, like, are you trying to go to a, cl a, a dance club or are you trying to like, circ like, navigate the Siberian winter? private room you say don't mind if I do who's watching politics and they're fucking what suspension of disbelief destroyed they're watching political debates in their freaking private room at the club sure yeah that's normal you're not insane what's over here this place is so nice to walk around in. there's all these little details about how it's like a little the colors everywhere and everything it's like just nice to see Look at this. Look at this. Someone had to make all this. This is someone's job. This is neat. Oh, ha. Uh, wait, these are, the, wait oh, these are padded walls, aren't they? It looked, at first I thought it was noise dampening foam, like the stuff that I use. Although it could serve the same purpose. Probably serves the same purpose. Hi. Oh yeah, it's like a... Was it Amsterdam, I think? Has the big red window dancers and everything. Hi. Aren't you sweet? You looking for a good time? She says without turning around. Okay. And I just stole Stripper's money. Don't bother trying to be tricky, sugar. They've been watching you since you set foot into the district. You stick out like... What do you Americans say? A sore thumb? Yes, that's it. Do people... When people say what do Americans say before saying something immediately with perfect clarity as if they... You know, knew it already. Uh, are, are they are there? Are they ever actually pausing to think? I, this is a genuine question. That all of you foreign, you know, non-American people li li watching this and so on. It, although I don't know if anyone literally ever says that for real either. <laughs> it's ever just like a movie trope. Like I, I don't know. It always comes off as super cheesy to me. I'm, st I'm just taking their shit basically. Okay, that's not a reasonable way to respond to random people uh, talking to you. Hello. It is my pleasure to serve you. What would you like? Ah, no combo. I'm all right for now. If that ever changes, I'll be here waiting. Just checking around for interaction opportunities. Is that a that's a chest up there? No, it's a oh, it's a box of champagne. I thought maybe there would be something stashed behind it. Newspaper. That might be about it for this place. I wish I knew they were so kind of here. I wouldn't have given them my business. Well, that's not very nice. For, for that, I'm turning off your heater. Or did I turn it on? Oh, it's on now. Yeah, it's... Let's get it heated up in this room. That's weird that when you turn the heater on, the light on the table goes away instead of adding... It would be great if this building had something like that. Alright. Got a bunch of watchdogs looking people around here. And hip. Oh wow, no Icarus. Weird. Though I was apparently jumping from far enough that it would have shown up. Are these things open? Oh, they do open. Hi. I can recognize a former police officer from Holloway. Once they learn the walk, they never forget it. I keep forgetting that the uh the vision thing makes you s listen differently. It just seems odd to me. Oh, yeah, that's the ground floor version of the place. Ooh, a biocell. That's kind of a big deal. At least it's a way to save on a decent chunk of parts for crafting. Alright. Let's go check out the stronghold then. And be polite. Close doors behind you. Hi. Get lost. This place is not for you. Turn around, Clank. We Yobki are not allowed inside. Yobki, okay. 
That's a, that's a new one for me. I don't think I've heard that word before. Alright, so the moment I set forward in there, I'm immediately in trouble. And my job is to not set off the alarm, so that's bad news for me. Hi there. Huh. Wow, this place really does light up at night, doesn't it? Are those mannequins up there? I bet I can go through the Irish stool to find a way in. Probably. By the way, uh, the DLC for the game came out, like, today or yesterday or whatever. I was actually about to fire it up and play it, but, uh... Uh, it has a warning saying that it may st spoil the main story, so even though it looks like a super side content thing, it might be spoilers, so since I'm since I'm taking apparently 500 times longer than everybody else to beat this game, I won't be playing the DLC until I'm done with the main campaign. Don't want to screw up and spoil things for myself or anything. So we'll get we'll, be, we'll get back around to that later, I suppose. It is funny though, like I don't feel like I'm... I usually don't feel like I'm wasting very much time when I'm playing this game. I feel like there's just a bunch of cool stuff everywhere. It seems that everybody else just rushed like crazy. I have seen Let's Plays of this game listed where their finale was part 12 and all their episodes were like the 20 to 30 minutes long. I'm like, did you race through the game and ignore everything? I think they literally did. There's nothing down here, is there? There's nothing down here. I'm really hoping for like a secret door to get me inside. Alright, so the Red Queen is probably my best way to get inside then if this place is this hopeless. Unless I have a way of getting upstairs. There's no sta other staircase here, ladder. It looks like a place might be up here. Oopsie. There we go. I might be able to go in that window. Oh, maybe not. Come on. And... Hit. No. Yes. Hello, lady. How are you doing? No? No? You know what? Something's been bothering me a little bit. Let's check it out. Graphics. Is this, is this game a motion blur? It does have motion blur. Let's fix that. Reduces hard edges on polygons. Less impact on performance when compared to... Okay. Depth of field. Yeah, let's try turning off motion blur and see if that helps at all. Uh, I could be wrong. I felt like something felt odd about moving around. It could just be that the game's inherently kind of twitchy when you're moving around. But the camera the camera's always felt really jerky to me. And it's not just the uh, controller, because it's also when I'm physically walking around, not, not only just when I look around. And it's been, bu it's been bugging me a little bit, because my, even my other first-person games don't seem to quite look like that when I'm playing them. Oh well. Either way, motion blur is usually kind of pointless. Yeah. So let's look for... Any kind of passageway I can use. Aha! Secret switch. Anyone in here? No? Restricted zone, you say? Well, we wouldn't want anyone to know about that. Alright, so... There's a Samus dot in here. That's unexpected. Have I read the new one yet? Oh yeah, that's the Eliza Kassan one. No, open. Okay, um... I'm sure you just hooked up to something, right? No? No? Wait, how does one ho how does one open the safe? Weird. There's no- usually there's a computer in here. Wow, all four of the- wow, every screen's the same thing. That seems less than efficient as far as security goes. Oh well. Oh, hey. I'm dumb. I'm sorry. That shouldn't be too hard to hack. Especially with all my new hacking security upgrades. Look at those low-ass percentages of detection that will probably immediately get me caught anyway. No? Man. Hacking stealth is a big deal. I kind of wonder... I don't know. Why... If you have... If you have hacking stealth... I feel like at that point, hacking's easy enough that you don't need all the other hacking upgrades, do you? They almost seem like a waste. All the other features you can go after. Alright. The unfortunate thing is that this is a different session than the session where I originally talked to her, so if she dropped plot details about how to get inside, I may have forgotten. Oopsie. Oh, whoa, oh. For some reason I thought it was a slide door. My bad. That's fine. We'll find our way in there. It'll be fine. We just gotta be sneaky. I can probably hop out of one of these windows, actually. Just sneak around. No? Not quite. Oh, that looks useful. All right. So the, by, by the Irish stool, there's a back alley that has a sewer. I can work with that. All right, so temp tackle. 
as the that's the Irish stool. Okay. So over here we've got sewer access. Please. What about me? What the fuck do I get out of this? Well, I might have an idea. Listen, I have a daughter. She's not too young. Almost sixteen. You sick bastard. Okay, forget I said anything. I didn't realize you'd object. And then they run away. That, that was interesting. Talking about probably selling his daughter into sexual slavery or something. And then they both sprint away realizing that somebody witnessed the conversation. Probably not. They probably ran away for completely unrelated reasons. But it, uh, it almost makes the AI feel like it worked. So we could hack our way in. Or I could just be all like, haha. Whoa, that was weird. Was that bush a solid object that you can't put a dumpster through? Anyway. Consider this problem solved. Whoa, I jump high. There we go. So down there's the sewer access. What's up here? Some of these environments just keep going. Uh probably can't hop up there. That's that's the boundaries of the map, I'm sure. Aha! Anyone in here? There's people behind the door. Oh. Oh, this is this is probably the volley territory. Well, yeah, without without me going into the sewers. Interesting. Just keep an eye on that corner map so I can see if any of those dots are coming towards me at any given moment. Let's turn you off just so I can focus on the other sounds. There's some medieval armor here. Look at this. They got a helm. They got halberds. Interesting. So I need to avoid setting off the alarm, so it would be good to find their central security location so I can disable any measures they have. Looks like they've got whiskey and war horns? Is that a rugby ball? A football. Okay. Well, we're inside. Might as well just update that. And see where we go from here. Punk. I never saw a man try harder to look like he came up from the streets. Dominique. He's got the ink. He's done time. Time in some Moscow boutique. Think he got that shit on his legs in prison? Radic made the call. You want to talk to Radic about who he recruits? Good luck. Ah, if he wants posers, my hometown is full of them. You know the deal. Some guys are for doing the shooting, and some are for getting shot. True to Deus Ex, Square Enix games. There's two characters having a pleasant conversation with each other, and then they go on to patrols the moment they finish. Alright, so... This is supposed to be my... That, that can't be it, right? That's a completely different objective, isn't it? The scientist's apartment? Yeah, that's telling me to leave to go to that one. So Dominic is somewhere here. Courtyard. Oh, these are all different. Uh, am I? Where am I? It says it calls it the Volley Apartments. Maybe the scientist apartments in the same area as as uh, Dominic, or maybe I'm losing track of something. I don't know. I can't look at the overworld map very well. Oh, over there is where Dominic's supposed to be, ish. So maybe... I don't know, we'll just explore and try not to raise alarms and see how it goes. So this is, uh... Probably, this might not be the safe house then, but instead... An individual person's room. Is he in the bathroom just now? Yeah, he is. Looking at his phone. Uh, it'd be easier to just knock him out. That'll save us t some time. Hey, buddy, old pal. How you doing? Now, no one will know, and, and these people have permanent brain damage or something. Everyone wins. You come into the bathroom. And we'll just pretend you guys had a wild ride. 
There we go. Can I bring you into the tub? I don't think it'll quite work out that way. The leverage is not easy. Oh well, we're in now. We're in an entirely new apartment complex to explore after doing so many in the past. But this one's special because it's the Crime Lord apartment place, so there's extra risk. And that I'm totally screwed across the board if they find me, probably. Oh, coffee machine. They've got the money. And there's a gun. Alright. See? I'm disarming the streets. I'm doing everyone a common service. Because I am so great. Look at me. Alright. More guns. So many guns. Whenever I find stashed guns, I can't- I always imagine like I'm just totally ruining somebody in the future because they're gonna like reflexively try to use that gun uh, when they're in danger or something and they stashed it for that exact situation and then it's gone and whoopsie. I could hack this probably. Let's keep it going. The important thing is that I believe in me. Go, 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 go. Yeah. Got it. Having Rich's ear won't save you. I do not care if your cousin was the fucking Tsar. It is fa uh, in this family, we do not rely on who knows who, but rather what you have done. You need to earn. If you're going to work my crew, you're going to work my way. You go off on your own like that again, I will fucking end you. Probably a good idea to knock out everybody I can find and keep stashing them in bathrooms or something. Just because this is a... If this entire apartment complex is theirs, then the moment an alarm goes off, I could be completely screwed. Because of just the sheer number of people that would be around to try to stop me. So it's probably a smart call to try to avoid that. Where's this camera? I don't see it. Is it down there? Oh, it's up there. Next floor up. Alright. There's a staircase that takes me higher. Oh, there's a camera right there. Well, I'm not really looking to get spotted by that dude, so let's just go away from him. There's the camera we saw on the ca on the uh, map. And <laughs> you can see the people sprawled over in the tub. That's great. Do you rotate? You do. Whoa, looking down the staircase. Hi. Oh, who's got a big gun? Yes, you do. And he's, uh, mommy's very proud. All right, and boop. They're not screwing around. They're patrolling their own apartment with a gun. That seems a little extreme, honestly. I updated the code to the control room in apartment 95. The code is 0666. Keep a close eye out to my night. Where does Kid uh, Kid like want to make a play for our friend Dominic? Okay, that's why they're. That's why they're alert then. That addresses the exact thing I was questioning. Is that they're already potentially aware of exactly what I'm here to do. But, no confirmation. As long as I don't blow it, we're there, they're good. Our inventory's completely full again. Uh... Let's drop all the beer. It's not that valuable. It's kind of just an inventory filler. And the revolver probably is worth more to sell than that. And that was exactly the number of slots I needed, so there's that. Alright, so I am I stand to make some money next time I get a chance to visit the store. I, I, do I have 23 bio cells? Wow. I remember not too long ago I was having incidents where I didn't have enough inventory space to, uh... I didn't have enough inventory space to even... I mean, no, I'm sorry, I didn't have enough bio cells to even use certain devices that require bio cells. So I started, I started like, uh... Trying to collect large amounts of them. <laughs> Um. Could you maybe not panic? Because I'm not here to hurt you. I'm not trying to hurt you, lady. Who is apparently not a guard. I thought that was a guard dot. I'm like, why don't I see a guard? Is, she, is he sleeping? And it's a panicked lady. And panic she is doing. Nope. It's a good thing to have this this sight turned on so I can see if there's anything stashed behind the boxes. Oh wow. So many credit chip opportunities. But yeah, I've been uh I've been collecting as much uh Oopsie. 
as much biocell and stuff like that, and not and 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 a lot of auto tools because there were there was a scarcity for them. You'll remember moments in the past where I just didn't have enough. Uh, I didn't I didn't have enough inventory uh, enough scrap to constantly make the number I needed. But then I upgraded my. Uh, yeah, she, she, I think she's just gonna lay there and panic forever, so I can just ignore her. Uh, I eventually got enough packing skull I didn't need my multi tools anymore, so those started stacking up. And at some point, I just started collecting bio cells a lot faster than I ever encountered the things that you actually need to power them with. Uh, them with. Camera is pointed at there. Okay. Do 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 we? Just didn't want to get caught. Can the camera see him over here? It's a bit of a concern. Is there a camera above me? No, it's below me. Okay. I don't know where where to think this thing will tr will turn. Oh, zero six six six. Got it. Anyone in here? Nope. This th this must be their security location then. All right, let's go drag this guy in here before he gets spotted. Don't want him out in the open. These dragged bodies are really resilient to being woken up by anything. There you go. Enjoy your corner. Hey, everyone's got frag grenades. Here. Old knockouts go in the bathroom. No exceptions. Except for that time, except for that, I'm pretty sure I knocked that other guy out in his in the bedroom and left him there. So, I am really bad at my own rules. Apparently, it's fine. It's fine. So, I think this might be the the location where I can deal with their security. Borderline magazine featured in this month's issue, exclusive this month. Cross border cogs. We examined the rise of human smuggling in the face of UN legislation controlling the movement of enhanced individuals. What are the effects of illegal og immigrants, and how do we stop them? Tight along the 49th. In rhetoric, recalling the pre roosevelt uh, Roosville, maybe? In rhetoric, recalling the pre roosevelt years, Canada threatens to dust off the Paulson program and once again fortify their border with the U.S. Checkpoint Prague. We spent a day in one of the city's finest. Oh, yeah. Finest. Regular features. Op-ed. Uh, is it wrong to tag and track OGs if our safety is at risk? Take him down or take him out. Steiner Bisley's Zenith Zap versus the Hurricane Machine Pistol by Stelzik Arms. And many more illuminating articles. Hurricane Machine Pistol. Huh. Hello, secret button. What did you do? What did you do? Oh, did you open this wall just now? Was was this wall not open a second ago? Oh, there's the control room. All right, so I found the thing that was our optional thing that could help us out here. Let's just keep looking around. So much opportunity for stashed stuff. Yeah, this is one way to deal with if anyone hears me. Seriously, if I was an AUG, I would do that all the time. If I was like in well in the hypothetical nonsensical situation where I'm supposedly infiltrating places and stuff like that, which is already a weird concept to me. Is this the balcony that oversees the city? Are you are? Wait, no, I think this is the courtyard that the... Oh uh, yeah, this is the Vali... the Diwali courtyard. So I can oversee it and I can see the theater over there, which is playing Are You Are. A lot of armed guards down there. This place is militarized as shit. Yeah, they really own this area. It's, it's not no minor thing, it's not the... It's not just a veiled threat of like, yeah, this is our territory because if anyone comes here, you're screwed. Like, no, it's... This place is like, literal, like, held borders. Finish setting up the security hub, password is that stuff. Uh... Really? Steel beams? It's, yeah, yeah, I know, feel free to change it. That's actually... Wow, okay, the, it's like they knew what I was gonna say. I just didn't want it to be anything stupid. I got a bad feeling about tonight. Their password is steel beams. It's okay. There's no jet fuel in this room today. All right. Uh, let's uh, enter password. Oh. Is this the password location? Here. Here we go. Yeah, okay. That's this computer. All right, so S-T-3. 
three three L B three A M five. Steel beams. Cameras. Uh, off, off, off. There we go. Alarm. We can trigger the alarm. Uh, no, let's disable the alarm panels instead. Ta-da! That's good. Yeah, we would not want to trigger the alarm. That would that would instantly fail my objective. Hello? Looking for stashed items, but not really finding them. No? Not a lot of, not a lot of luck today? It's pretty much just a computer room and a lot of coffee. And they didn't even leave any for me. They drank it all like some sort of barbarians. Terrible hosts, honestly. I'll have to break into nicer people's houses later. I think that's all we're getting out of here. Hey, look, that's the noise damn. That's that's the noise canceling foam I was talking about. Okay. Okay. No. No. Level designer. You wouldn't stick posted notes and what the fuck is this? What the fuck? It's not a cork board. It's noise canceling foam. It's not even like thick or anything. It, it doesn't like hold weight. And like all these things are floating. That that there's there's totally supposed to be like a cork board here or something for all these things to be stabbed into. But instead, it's noise canceling foam. And like most of these post-it notes are just floating in, in air. And that post-it note that post-it note has a pin in it. Do you want a pin thing or a post-it note? I have so many problems with this wall right now. What in the world? That's not how noise canceling foam supposed to be used in her house. I have so okay. You guys are crazy. <laughs> Diwali, if the Diwali family doesn't know when to quit, I better bring these fuckers down before they ruin the society with their inability to understand noise-canceling foam and its many virtues and or other things, I guess. I don't know. Which one goes to the green? I don't know. Let's click on everything until I find it. I did it. There we go. <laughs> I fucked up. From Abram Grinnin to Gleb... Schlast... Shas live to sev. To sev. Shas. Shas live to sev. Shas live to sev. That's a motherfucker. <laughs> it just keeps going. <laughs> I killed one of the girls last night. I drank too much and brought one of them home from the audition. Not the cream. Don't worry. Just one of those. Uh, one of those the Redditch would have sent to his porno friends in Moscow. Uh, we were having a good time, a real good time. But then I don't know what happened. I guess I drank too much. I couldn't get it up. The robot bitch started fucking laughing. Laughing at me. Saying if I was crippled, I'd get augmented like her. Imagine that shit. She would not fucking stop. So I made her stop. I didn't mean for it to go so wrong. I just wanted her to stop laughing at me. The place is clean. I fixed it up this morning. No sign of her. I do not think anyone saw us leave together, but... She might be missed? I don't know. I wouldn't want something like this to come at to Redditch's attention. What should I do? Well, shit. You done fucked up. You done fucked up. And that's also that's actually like right up there. To an, oh, hello, item. That's actually kind of in line with what happened in the first game. What was that? Oh, it's ammo. I don't have it. I have space for. Who keeps ammo up there? How would you access it in an emergency situation? Oh, there's stuff up there too. Holy crap! Hang on a second. Oopsie. No, don't stop jumping on the thing. I'm trying to jump up. Goddamn lamp. What is that? Lancer rifle. But that, that's straight up with the... Uh, that's in the territory of the narrative we had in the previous game. Oh, I should craft stuff. I have too many crafting parts that's taking up space. Um, Multi-tools don't hurt usually. Actually, what I should do is I should upgrade my weapon. Just... Uh, it might not even really matter ultimately uh, what the upgrade is, but might as well just buy them because they exist. Like, ammo capacity upgrades. There we go. Now it holds 14 shots without a reload. And that took us below the two, the 1k. So now we have more slots open. Oh yeah, I just realized for a second ago that I'm like, Oh yeah, I have so much of that stacked up that, uh... That, uh, it's taking multiple slots again. That's like my... That's my threshold for... I better spend some of this immediately, even if I don't need it. Because a lot of the stuff that uh, it would be spent on doesn't take up inventory... Doesn't take up inventory space or, or stacks. What would I want to remove? Combat rifle... I don't know. I, I could swap out a bunch of ammo, potentially, and then probably be worth it. Jesus Christ, there's so much stuff in here. You know what? It just doesn't matter that much, I guess. 
The important thing is I have so much stuff in my inventory that I will make money next time I visit a vendor. <laughs> but it is, it is a bummer to leave something like that behind. Alright, so all their security cameras and stuff are turned off, so that's good. Just overwrite my save real quick. But yeah, what happened there was definitely in the territory of uh, the first game where you find out that Malik's uh, friend was was uh, killed. And it's the same sort of dark territory where the, per where the person who killed them isn't all like... They're, they're, the stuff they're talking about isn't about how they're so remorseful and like, I can't believe it happened, I don't know, how could I do such a thing? Instead, it's, instead their response is, how do I make sure this doesn't come back to bite me in the ass? And it's like, oh, yeah, no big deal, it was just a human life you took, but yeah, let's, let's worry about you today.